Okay, so let's look at an example where we've got different units for our inf influent and effluent and calculate the efficiency. So this time, let's start with an influent TSS equal to 200 milligrams per liter, and we'll say that The effluent TSS is 0 0.05 grams per liter. Okay. So we're going to solve this in two steps because the first thing we notice is that the grams per liter is not the same as the milligrams per liter. So the first step, let's just, let me just change colors here. So step one is to Let's convert the effluent TSS to milligrams per liter. And then for step two, now we'll just calculate that percent removal efficiency, which we call R. Okay. So looking at step one, Right. We have 0 0.05 grams per liter, and we want to convert it into milligrams per liter. So that is just 1,000 milligrams per gram, and that tells us that that is now 50 milligrams per liter. So then we can go right on to step two. Here. So now we're just going to calculate that R value, the removal efficiency. So just remember that R is in minus out over in times 100. So we have this as 200 minus 50, and these are all in milligrams per liter divided by 200 milligrams per liter times 100, and we will get 75%. So now we've done two removal efficiency calculations, one where the units were the same and one where the units were different, and so we had to add in a little extra step. Uh, and then we do the actual calculation.